NASA scientists destroyed a multi-million dollar space probe last night and well, they're celebrating this. Yeah, it was an experiment to see if a potential threat to Earth could be stopped. NASA will take weeks to find out if that test was a success. But as Mark Strassman shows us, the scientists like what they've seen so far. Oh, my goodness. Look at Nearly that. 7 million miles from Earth, you're watching a spacecraft moving at roughly 4 miles per second, heading into a harmless asteroid. <laughs> and we have and impact. We it was called DART the double asteroid redirection test, the spacecraft slamming by design head-on into an asteroid named Dimorphos, its camera going dark, signifying impact. Astronomers around the world have shared images from their telescopes. You can see a cloud created by the high-speed collision. And liftoff. NASA launched DART back in November. Its mission, not seek and destroy, but seek and deflect hit the asteroid, and slightly alter its trajectory. But that difference could make a hypothetical threatening asteroid miss Earth in the future. The threat is very real. Uh, those uh, asteroids are certainly out there. In a couple months, NASA will know for sure whether the $300 million plus experiment worked. In this crash, the spacecraft lost. But with luck, planet Earth won. Mark Strassman, CBS News. Of course, a lot of referrals to the movie Armageddon. Which... Right. In that case, though, they had humans who had to go up and <laughs> drill in. This is a little different, thanks to How technology, right? Fascinating. And do unmanned this, spacecraft to be able My to do this. Goodness. Yeah, incredible. Well, NASA also released a new image from the James Webb Telescope of a spiral galaxy named IC5332. It's more than 29 million light years from Earth. That's a long way. Yeah. Photo released today also includes an image of the same galaxy as seen by Hubble. Now, the spectacular image features the spiral galaxy shown here in unprecedented detail thanks to observations from the Mid-Infrared Instrument, or MIRI, which is mounted on the James Webb Space Telescope. IC5332 has a diameter of roughly 66,000 light years, making it a little larger than the Milky Way. It's notable for being almost perfectly face-on with respect to Earth, allowing us to admire the symmetrical sweep of its spiral arms. Looks it needs a better name, though. Yeah. <laughs> I it see just looks that. like a painting of some right. kind. My it's goodness. stunning, and yeah. that exists out there. Oh, yeah. Wow.